don't even know how to do anything. I'm <laughs> So here we are, um, I'm gonna show you guys around a little bit and show you where um, we rehearse at the moment for our Feel It All tour um, and just follow me and i show you guys around. Everything gets prepared, we have like all our cases here, everyone's uh, the guitars are getting checked and then we have a little uh, workout area here. This is where we work out a little bit. I'm not doing it too much. Uh, as you can see, but um, I should. But Tom and Georg are doing it sometimes. And this is where the magic happens. <laughs> Here we are, this is our little um, private area. This is where all the pre-production happens, where we arrange the songs and where we uh, just rehearse just ourselves. We have our little area here where we have all our instruments. This is where we like chill, have a little TV, a little couch area. So I can show you guys my room real quick. It's super small, just a bed and then I have like so much clothing and shit and stuff because Tom and me have to bring so much because we're not living in Germany so uh, we just uh, bring a lot of bags and a lot of clothing and stuff um, it's a little messy but it works out it's just very small of course we uh, have a couple of um, bathrooms so we have like a bunch of uh, toilets um, and then we have a couple of showers because we all need to get ready and then sometimes in the morning or after we rehearsed um, it needs to be like super fast so we have a couple of them so we don't have to like share too much um, it's all pretty messy because we're all boys and no one's cleaning up no Georg is cleaning up a lot I have to say so this is our little kitchen area um, this is the most important thing right here the most important thing to uh, get coffee um, we don't really cook that much I have to say so we order in uh, most of the time um, but we have like all our junk food in there and um, so in the morning usually we have um, breakfast at this table and we check our emails and we go through our daily schedule and talk about the stuff we're gonna do and this is like Tom's most um, important area and Tom is doing also the whole pre-production for the whole set so uh, he has to arrange a lot of stuff on the computer and there's a lot of uh, technology that goes into it it's uh, so much more than on all the other tours so it's um, it's just a lot of stuff I have no idea about it I just have to sing that's a good thing this is for a massive big drum set I have to say everything I use I use everything he uses everything so everything just really, once in one song we but I really use it. need that big drum set so um, yeah it's it's massive but their room is great because we uh, don't hear anything, anything. out there <laughs> uh, we only work with our in ear monitoring so that's 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 the perfect setup um, to rehearse the songs and arrange everything don't look back, just let it go We didn't know because when you're producing an album and especially an album like this you you don't know how this is gonna work out live I think like in the process we got more comfortable and we, we got excited about you know going on tour and doing this because we saw it's 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 working out you know even even live and um, we are trying so many new things and everyone's stepping out of the comfort zone everyone's uh, playing new instruments and and drums and keys and um, we have so much new stuff um, I think no one of us is just doing his normal thing I mean Georg he's playing drums and he's playing bass and keys and um, it's just it's just a lot of a lot of stuff for everyone to learn and be comfortable with and Tom is playing the piano as well um, it's crazy it's, it's so funny because because it's you know it's totally out of like Georg's comfort zone he's trying something new and it's I think it's super super funny and it's super fun for everyone to do that uh, and especially Pumba loves it he's just getting so hyped up when people like doing something with their hands or they're like doing something with their feet and he always thinks it's you know meant to be for him and he wants to play um, so he doesn't really get the the difference between like someone's playing with him or someone's playing an instrument and doing something else So he always gets like way too excited 
<laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I think now that we figured out in the process that everything sounds great and that it actually works out, it's like it's a lot of fun. Small man, big drum set. Gustav got a massive drum set, and when he ordered it, no one had an idea because we were kind of planning to like strip it down for the club situation because we don't have a lot of space. Of course he needs it, so <laughs> Gustav is like, I mean, he just loves to play his drums. You know, whenever he, you know, he gets something like that and he prepares his drum set for the tour, he gets like super excited and he's... Your well. coffee, sire. Oh, thank you very much. You're welcome. I feel like whenever Gustav is behind his drum set, it's like so hard for him to not play it. <laughs> it's like working for the TV. 50% you have to wait. Or is that? Beautiful guitar player and a fabulous bass player. I think a lot of the stuff we do is never done before live on stage. So um, we are we are trying to find ways also. Like we didn't even know when we came in here how to do it. So we just figured everything out. So we have an extra laptop for like vocal processing. We're using the the live effects of what we were using in the studio to recreate the sound um, live. And it's also of course it's a little different, but we are trying to recreate exactly the sound which we were using in the studio and, and make it sound amazing. play a song and you know do it it takes so much time for me it's like a lot of waiting and I don't even need to rehearse as much as the other other um, guys too because I'm very um, easy and fast and quick with learning <laughs> as I said like for this too is like so super hard because everyone um, everyone has to like do different things because we are not enough musicians to actually play the songs. So the problem with Invaded, for example, was that Tom has to play the piano and someone needs to play the guitar. So he said, oh, it's like super easy, Bill. Like maybe you should just do it. And I thought it would be fun to try it out. Tom said, okay, you need to like learn it. It's super easy. He showed it to me and I'm, I mean, I'm just, I'm just, I'm, for me it's very hard to learn stuff like that and I have no patience. So I tried once and if that doesn't work, I like, I, I just can't do it. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Das kann ich überhaupt nicht halten. Na guck mal ganz kurz. Hier, du musst den Dame, guck mal ganz kurz. Das krieg ich nie hin. I don't even know how to do anything on the guitar because I never play guitar. So uh, he showed it to me. I tried a couple of times and then I said, no, I'm not gonna do it. We are very excited and we are very 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 nervous I mean we were kind of talking about like oh like in before the first show we're gonna pee our pants and we're gonna be so <laughs> we're gonna be so nervous I can't wait to you know see see the fans and see how they react if they like the show um, and actually like playing together just the four of us I think overall just like being together in this in you know in that rehearsal space and playing the songs we are all super super excited and um, we are happy, we're just happy to like put together a show and go uh, and be on stage again.
честно.